Quiet on the set. Let's go ahead and roll that Tim in three to one action. Sociopath, wow. how you big fat, out of shape, diabetic, high blood pressure. What's your name and badge number? Are you detaining me? I'm at. All right, you're Are okay. You done pushing no. Dad, I'm going back okay, over Joe. there. Joe, there's a thumb. Blow me. What are you out of your mind, bro? You just walk up to somebody on a public sidewalk. Face away from me. What did I do? You have a gun in your waistband. I've got one that can see. In this vid. We're gonna take a look at some of the guys who get blamed for everything wrong with the Auditing community today. Whether it's one of those West Coast cats in front of a church or smurfing somebody out, that Denver crew standing cops grills. You fat and worthless pig. Or those Arizona give me liberty to give me deaf nickels. You Don't make like me defend thing. myself. I feel threatened by you. Back up! Speaking of that word, uh, stop being ignorant and changing the subject. The five times, sir. Blow me, oh, nigga, county that, six. That, that, that cat in Chicago, they stay in my comments. So, uh, if your ugly ass up tonight, it roll over off your ugly ass wife. There you go. What are you gonna talk what? about my wife for? Cause I can't stand you, nigga. I'll be honest with you. I feel like I'm off my square out there yelling at this cat. But this bully had more complaints than I think 97% of the cops in Chicago. And that's saying something. Well, he's gone. And the young cats out there that day managed to make a new friend. I like you, bro. They call me Greek Freak around here. Greek Freak? Just like Giannis. So cool, like baby. Husband. Let's go to Texas. Hey, what's your name and your badge number, sir? Manuel Mata, young, relatively new cat, also has a reputation for being disrespectful. She said, I'm going to swear or affirm testimony given this cause to be the truth, whole truth, and nothing but the truth, self of God. I don't know what this is about. Hey, Judge, may we approach? I don't understand what's going on. Sure. Uh, what, sir? What's going on? What did I do? I need, I need my lawyer present, sir. We will get you a lawyer. You question me without a lawyer present. I think the argument goes something like, if you're disrespectful to authority, they'll create new laws and take away everyone's rights. Well, if someone can take them, you never had them to begin with. They're contingent like your right to counsel this is absolutely insane I, I don't i i don't think i've ever seen something like that you get you get a, you get accosted you get a, you get asked questions you get you know asked to be sworn in for no reason and when you try to ask for clarification as to why you're being sworn in you get arrested i'm sorry i have a problem with this oh i, I mean, I, yeah. I mean I'm, I'm just i have a problem with this i mean this is a huge problem and i think this judge should be I mean, he should be an inve he should be investigated for this decision. Get off of me, man! The right to film your public employees. Inappropriate. Oh, get off me, bitch! That's it. That's it. You know, man. The right to film a cop in the course of their duties. Okay, well, I'm gonna have you move that way, man. For what? You can't be, you can't be this close to a traffic stop. I, look, I'm on the public sidewalk. Y'all don't have authority over the sidewalk, bro. You're causing. I'm not You're causing shit. He's smart. he's he's conducting his traffic stop, isn't You're he? You're taking my attention away from this Yours. Vehicle. Yours. Get over there, man. Y'all back up. Y'all back up, man. It's not going to work. No that shit's over with. Right no, I'm not. He's conducting seconds. his traffic stop. You're going to go. We're going to take you to jail. It's simple. You've probably walked down a sidewalk and saw a cop giving someone a ticket. According to that cop, you broke the law. And if we're trying to determine who's worse here, the auditor or the cop, this one's obvious. We're going to have to look harder. And some of you still believe that you have the right to record the police. But you're wrong. And Mata is in danger once again. That's the thing about it. That's the beauty of it. That's the beauty of it. What's your name and badge number? Are you detaining me? I'm at. Don't worry. It's, everything's on camera. Everything's on our camera. You going to put the camera in my face? It, no, I didn't put you it didn't in your face. Fear, sir? You walked up to me. We don't mind you filming, just back up for us, please. You're welcome to film, I need you to back up. Same energy, same lies. But this cop just walked up on Direct D. Now he's a veteran, well seasoned like Sunday's soul food. Let's see how he handles it. That is an order. Move. Don't touch me, dude. Hey, no. 
Touch me. You are too close That's to our stop. That's use of force. You better check yourself. Back you up. You want a lawsuit? What's your name and your badge Back number? Back up. It's Sergeant Walter. Badge 8360. I'm asking Great. you. You're within about you 10 yards. So what? There's no... F- Back don't touch up, me. Or you're going to go to you jail. You better be filming this shit. This is a lawsuit, buddy. Dude, you're, there is you're no welcome rules. to film. Do you have tape up? Do you have... You are welcome. No, I don't have to. No, I don't have to. You do. No, this is a I public don't. area. I can be here. I'm asking you to you're back You're asking up. me. You just said you were ordering me. Now you're asking me. What is it? I haven't done huh? anything illegal. So you no, better but check you yourself. are too close. That's yes. not illegal. I can tell. Yes, it is. No, it is. What law is that? State the ARS. You are too close. State the ARS. You are too close. Exactly. For our safety, it's... Just... What's the ARS for too close? Come Please on, man. Please state it. Got him. You could have come up with the, come on, man, be nice. But you put your hands on me, you stupid... I... Oh, yeah. Dude, this is a freedom of speech. Dude, I know my Which rights. Is, I got laws in my pocket right which here. Which is fine. I, I asked got you laws. You want to see the laws? You guys are asking. Here's Houston versus Hill. I did Here's ask Houston versus Houston Hill for interfering. I got ARSs right here. You want to see the ARSs? That's fine. That's you want to see the fucking ARSs? I carry laminated ARSs in a pocket constitution, you stupid mother. Saw what? Shame on you. Show him man, you in your hand. And I saved the best for last. Look at his cat. Obviously an agitator. I mean, look at him. He even got a beard. And he out there agitating good church folk. Shame on him. Shame on you! Wait, what? Shame! This is shameful behavior, man. This is not God being like. Now I'm confused. There's no way he could be justified out there chastising good church folk. I mean, obviously they know best. Let's back it up and see if this cat has legitimate beef. Position three, scene one, We've got a newcomer, actor on scene, black dress, three, two, one, action. All right, he out there doing some lightweight trolling, which I personally find hilarious. Let's see how this goes bad. Newcomer walking through, three, two, one, action. And cut, that was perfect. That was great. I like the black dress scene. It's perfect. Hold the scene, scene interruption. We got background noise, background movement. Hold the scene. Cut. Hello? Hello? Hello, who's this? Hello, who's this? What are you doing? Hello, hello, who's this? Who is this? Cat, he's not answering the questions. Let me go ahead and delete the video. Hold on, I gotta delete this scene real quick. It didn't work. Exiting vehicle, three, two, one, action! Cat! That was great! <laughs> Cut, that's the wrong line. What did you say? You forgot the line? Did you forget the line? That was not the line. This is not funny. The line was perfect. Let's do it again. Okay, ready? Three, two, one, action! I can't believe I have to retell you the lines. Didn't you get the email? Did you get the notification? The kids in the back are cracking up, but shit just got unfunny. This man is calling armed men to confront a guy over a joke. I think we've proven today that cops can be unpredictable, even dangerous. I mean, what if one of them pulls a gun on this guy? I'd be furious. Hey, what's wrong with you guys? You guys call the cops? Hey, drop your, drop your camera. What? Put your camera on the ground. Why? Put your camera on the ground. For what? Set the camera on the ground. What did I do? Just follow directions and we'll explain to you. No, I don't agree to this. Place the camera on the floor. I don't agree it. I don't, I'm, not, I'm not agreeing to this. Okay, lead it on the fence or whatever, but put it away from your, from your reach. Why? Because I'm telling you to put it away. Are you violating my rights right now? Because I need your hands to be available. Are you violating my rights? Put it on the ground. Put your hands above your head. Are you violating my rights? Put your hands above your head. Are you violating my rights right now? Turn around. Why are you violating my rights? I didn't break the law. What law have I broken? Sir, put your hands up above your head. They're already above my head. Turn around away. Face away from me. For what? Face away from me. 
What did I do? You have a gun in your waistband. I don't have a gun. Your head and turn I don't have a gun. I can't hear you. Put your hands up on your head and turn around now. Now. Hey, Bo, hey, Bo. I got it. Hey, we're here because someone calls you to have a gun in your waistband. I don't have a gun, man. Yeah, it looks like a gun here. It's a taser, man. Look. Okay. Take a look. So That's it. That it's that simple. Turn around for us now. Keep your hands up, all right? Let us figure it out. If it's not a gun, we're going to move on to it. We're going to move on to it. We're going to move on to it. Let's just figure this out, right? I don't give you guys authority to search me, though, man. Okay, we're gonna get that. You could check it out, but you're not going to search me. Go ahead. Come on. Let's go. Now, yeah, slowly walk back to the sound of my voice. Go ahead. Go ahead. And for the sheep in the cheap seats, I can already hear them. It could have been a gun. Cops got to make it home safe to his family. What else did you expect him to do? Well, you're in luck. SGV here and a cop who actually is good at his job is going to present you an alternative that doesn't require pointing a half a dozen guns at someone's head and putting actual lives in danger. That's him. That's her. Three, two, one, action. Hey, how you doing? Hey, sir. Street, Thanks for coming down, man. Uh, what do we own this uh, pleasure? Huh? To what oh, do we own this pleasure? Someone called and said somebody was out here with guns. Oh, whoa! Yeah, that's what someone said. Oh. With guns, that's huh? Said, yeah. Right on, man. Okay. All right, you. Good. All right. All right, good. This guy training you good or what? This guy has a great training good attitude, man. Like oh, you're yeah. Yeah. That's good, man. Have any weapons on you? Nothing's gonna hurt us. Uh, that's your question, man. We looked them up. They look like magnum They look like they just need to be They had a YouTube channel for SPT News. I don't know what they're about. Oh, dang. Constitutional rights. We're an aerospace manufacturing company. Customers are Airbus, Boeing. We have amazing employees. Why are they here? But you know, we have a lot of employees. Why are they here? Why are they here? But you know, you know when you're driving out? You guys are able to leave the business, okay. come into the business freely. No one's even eating so you guys. You're just ignoring them. Like, yeah, exactly. Education in progress. Three, two, one, action. Sick. Uh, yeah, Officer Bird. Yes, sir. Training of uh, FTO, right? Yes, sir. Give you the respect you deserve, man. You're a great officer, a great training officer. I hope you train a lot more officers out here, man. Yes, sir. Thank Love you, your attitude. Appreciate Great that. work today, man. Thank you, sir. I appreciate that. Thank you. Right. You guys be safe out there. Right. Cut. If you don't mind me, if you don't mind me asking, if you don't mind me asking, you can keep recording. Well, what are those? Are those fire? I'm just kidding. No, it's just those tasers. Just tasers. Oh, okay, yeah. I, okay. I've seen, I've seen it once before when I was on like 204 Street or whatever, and everyone kind of overreacted. Yeah. From a distance, you can't tell. Yeah. All right. I was just thinking like, uh, I think they would at least tell us. Yeah, yeah. If it was a firearm or not, but yeah. I just wanted to make sure. No, you guys right. are good. Cool. You had your officer behind me watching your back and these guys watching yeah, your front. Yeah, we're all good. So. Well, honestly, I don't have an issue with what you guys come out here to do. We're all about educating the public. That's right. So it doesn't be become a physical altercation then someone has to go to jail. That's right, man. But Thank you. It's just one of those situations. Appreciate you, man. Just, Thank you. Um, just do me a favor, guys. When traffic comes in and out, just let them come through. I yeah, know you guys know this. We I just got that, educate man. Everyone. Yeah, we're not here to MP. You know that. Have a good one. I think we can all agree that that cop did well. So I think the debate as to whether or not these cats should stay in cops' faces and citizens has concluded. If you can see, it's now obvious that all the money you spent didn't train that one good cop. It was cats like this, vids like these. Now I gotta get out of here, but SGV ain't done. He's headed back to that church to point out how happy they were when they thought a bunch of armed men were about to kidnap him from his family. What's wrong is you almost had me arrested for your life. Your people are lying. Your people are lying. No, what's wrong? Your people lied to the police, told them I had a gun. No, nobody's here. Yeah.